Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Ellis Toys Review. Today we're going to be reviewing uh, Mega Man X, uh, one, one Toast Scum Plastic Model. Uh, as you can see, this is a Force Armor version. So let's get into it. And here we have a model completely finished. Uh, I gotta say, sculpting wise, it, it's really nice. He was easy to build. Um, he does stand out with that red and yellow. He really seeks attention. The transparent greens on him um, helps it a lot. It, it's just a very eye-catching model. Um, so it'll matter from which side you look at it from. That red really attracts your attention. Um, I have to say even from the bottom, A green transparent just really works with this uh, with this Mega Man. Face wise, he comes with uh, three different faces. So here's the first one, normal plain face, a uh, smirky face looking sideways, and uh, angry looking face. I'm a little disappointed that we didn't get a screaming face like this one, but. At least we got one of them that, where he's angry. So besides the cannon, you could actually have both hands. Uh, but he has multiple different hands. So here he is with closed fist hands. A pair of open grabby hands. You can see. And a pair of uh, hands that are open. Ready to uh, smack someone or... Yeah. So here is the canyon. And the cool part is you could put it on either hand. So here he is with the cannon on. Um, he is compatible with other Mega Man, so he is easy to come off. Parts come off uh, a little bit too easy, I think. But everything seems to be placed in the right order. Um, and he does have good uh, poses, so he's not flimsy. Um, so that's good. The only thing might be that the legs might be a little too big. So over time, I'm pretty sure they're going to be a little bit flimsy. But like I said, parts do come off a little bit too easy. But you should be able to pop them in. See, because due to the weight, it's slowly going down. But most parts tends to stay where, where you want. So the head, you do have a ball, ball joint on it, even the neck, you can move it side to side, forward and forward like a chicken. Uh, arms do stretch. Uh, you can do a whole 360 with them. Um, same thing with this. He does have some pivot here. Go back and forth. And then if the waist, you could do more. Back and forth from the waist. Do a little belly dance. Uh, he does have more movement from here. It seems to be in a ball joint. So he has a beautiful spread to move forward backwards nice up nice bend but then you have this exposed um but yeah can move up and as you guys saw when this came off this is in a ball joint so you have great ankle pivot but you go also move it forward and you can move the leg a little bit up so you can move it up and down 
as well. This is two ball jokes. The other thing that comes with is this beautiful, amazing blast. As you can see here, it's really big, really nice. And it has two different parts where you could combine it. So you have this part right here, which shoots from all four. And if you decided to uh, have a different gun, maybe one canyon, well, they got you covered. You just take off this one and replace it with, and that way you could have a singular point. And the other thing I saw was they took this apart uh, from the bottom and they used it kind of like he's gonna charge a blast. So it could look like he has shock waves. Or you could just combine it. Um, I haven't put it together, but you could put it together and you can make it look like uh, he's running really fast and you put it behind him somehow. And this is what I mean, kind of like a dash, uh, if you pose it. So you can make it look like he took like a dash, kind of like in the game. Overall, I like this one. Uh, it was fun building him. Uh, it didn't took that long. I actually enjoyed building um, this Mega Man. It's my first one that I built. Um, the only problem I do have with him is this leg does come off a little bit too, uh, a little bit too easy. It might be a little bit too loose, the to plastic or something. Um, so, but it's something that a little bit of glue to tighten it can help. Um, but yeah, uh, overall, I like them. Uh, it was a little bit expensive. So, but yet again, it's a Mega Man. Uh, I like it. So, yeah. I give it a nice thumbs up. All right. Oh, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment, and let me know if there's any other toy you guys want me to review. All right, later.